Good evening, those who listen. It's January 11th, 2024, 10.46 p.m., and this is why I never put dates on anything. Uh, remember, nobody knows the day or the hour of the return of Jesus. So, and I have, you know, my certain beliefs and theories on that, on the whole thing, but... Uh, whenever you call for days that could be the rapture, you know, it's just going to let people down, you know, people are, you know, if they're really truly expecting it to be that day and it doesn't happen, they're going to be let down. And then it's going to be like the, 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 the boy that cried wolf after a while, people aren't going to believe it anymore. And that's not good because we should always be ready because we don't know when he's coming. And that, I'm trying to find a date for it. You know, you can, I think it's, you know, it's okay to try to look for an, uh, a roundabout, but I don't think we should be trying to pinpoint the day or the hour in the first place. I think everything will work out the way it's supposed to that, you know, as long as we're, we believe and as long as, you know, we're always ready. Um... What was I going to say? Uh, I've been trying to do... Uh, today is the first day I got the stream yard back so I can do live streams again. I wanted to do the top Christian songs from 2023. And I just wanted to praise the Lord, too. Uh, having some more breathing problems, but I've been walking up and down the stairs. I've had to do laundry, and that's always a... A problem so if I'm out of breath sounds like I'm out of breath it is I'm out of breath <clears throat> but praise God you know uh, I think you know things are going to start happening so I think we should always you know be ready and just always be praying always be uh, praising the Lord you know singing songs Christian songs obviously um, but you know we should just be ready and we should always have the full armor of God and just be ready I have this feeling that this here's a here's a theory I'll just throw out there now I don't know everything so just it's a theory but say maybe the the eclipse that's coming on April 8th could that be an eclipse with planet X and is that maybe the same time that Planet X passes by? If that was the case, then there would be blackouts, everything, boom, But I don't know. I'm just throwing that out there. So just saying. And, you know, the thing with the, with the chart that you wound up having, let me click into it, you know, It's amazing, though, if, if, you know, if that's true. I mean, I never looked it up. I just took his word for it. <clears throat> that, you know, the distance, the time difference between each eclipse coincides with everything in the future. And then it's like this one, the last one, which is the last eclipse we had. Well, you don't see it on here because it's farther down the list, but. And it's the, the shortest distance, or shortest time, I should say, 89 days, and then 89 days. And then it goes back up and up and up, where they're, they're farther apart again. Hmm. So to me, that seems funny, too. So just throwing it out there. But I'm going to try to do some Christian music. If you just want to come on over and listen to some Christian music, praise God, have some fellowship, come on over. It's, I know it's kind of late for... United States, I was trying to do it earlier, but then, I don't know, something weird happened, and I had to take a little nap, <clears throat> but I'm trying, you know, there, you know, it seems like it is harder and harder to be able to do things uh, that is godly, you know, on this channel, so, I don't know, maybe, whatever, here we go. We're going to do some Christian music. Look for it soon after this video has been published. Thanks for watching. God bless.